What's up, Hannah? Hey, boo boo. Uh, yeah, we're getting ready to cook. So I just made me some of this. Um, it's very, very, very um, stevia flavored. And it does not mix well in a shaker bottle. However, it does do good in the blender. This is my Vitamix, which I love. Her name is Bertha. One of the things you're going to have to learn is there are... Everything has a name in my kitchen. This is Gunther. We have Big Bertha, my Vitamix. Microwave is named Rachel. My stove is Ross. My dishwasher is Monica. Um, that's not the house line I was talking about. I was talking about the red one. <laughs> but we'll, we'll do this one. This is my house line so that I can keep an eye on Joy. Um, just put it down. So, hey, girlfriend. So, mm. it is Father's Day. And I, my hubby is at church playing. So, I'm about to start cooking his favorite meal, tater tot casserole. And um, I'm going to be um, making some brownies. In and I'm about to do the towels. Mm. <laughs> yep, very important. Um, not those towels. The bed, the towels in my bedroom. I'll get it. Oh. Joy, joy. And this is why we have the house line on her. Good girl. Yes, good girl. Good. So one of the things I'm going to employ while I'm cooking, since these are just sweet potatoes. Yes. Oh. I want to encourage the whoopers that, see, see that. Um, hanging out with me is great. Joy, speak. Yes. Hannah, sit. Hannah. Yes, good sit. Alrighty, good job. So I can give them these for hanging out with me um and not have nasty dog treat hands because that weirds me out um so my secret to really really good tater tot casserole is these they are pre-seasoned with roasted garlic cracked pepper and i believe there's chives and sour cream oh no i'm gonna have to go check so i'll be right back Okay. You say cheese? Cheese! Yeah, I don't know how to take a still in the thing. Um, okay, you do not need to be playing with that. This is why I didn't want, want you to get this one out, okay? So go get the bread one, and we're going to put it on. That way I can... You, sir, need a diaper change. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, when I say I'm busy, I... Y'all, this is actually a quiet moment in my house. Um, so, but yeah, so the secret is this. I also, I know a lot of people when they make tater tot casserole, they line the bottom of the casserole dish with the tater tots and then do, um, the cream of chicken or cream of mushroom. I hope I have enough cheese. Um, come on, Bertha. These cable little managers are great if you can get it to work. Yeah, I can drop some of these links some of my little kitchen stuff if y'all want okay so bertha's gonna go up she actually goes up the top i gotta reorganize my kitchen. but i'm letting these thaw so that we can get a better cook um so we just i gotta get a new rag out i normally have uh rags out for cleaning all the time and i use a special spray um but yeah um and i have to put my trash we had to move our trash can into our garage stoop Joy, make sure she doesn't run off and try to eat something she shouldn't. But we had to move the trash can from the kitchen to the garage because um, a sweet little uh, tottering boy, yeah, he likes to um, he likes to go dumpster diving. So uh, yeah, so I've run this with soapy water. I'm gonna have to wash that. I'm gonna make my tear tot. Oh, this is the brownie. Okay, this can be good. We're going to have to get Bin Boo 
his own camera. I don't know if you can see very well in there. We got to get some better lighting. There is not very much light coming in there. But this is what he picked for his dessert for today. So we're doing tater tot casserole and brownies with peanut butter cookies. So, um, yeah, he just decided to give me double the work with a box. I was like, oh, get a box of brownies because that's easy versus having to make something homemade. And he picked the double the work one which is fine. I am happy to do it. I don't begrudge him. It's just, it's a little chaotic in my house. So I got my protein sheet. Okay. Yep. Good job. You want to go do the laundry? Can someone, can you please give me a hand by opening the garage door? Mm-hmm. Thank you. Oh, where's Joy? Ah, there she is. Come on. Yes, good girl. See, this is why we have to keep a house line on her. Because a girly friend will, um, behind me. I'm going to turn on the light. Um, girly friend likes to get into stuff. It is grooming week. Jeez. I love you. Oh. It's your daddy's father's day. Did you wish him a happy father's day? I oh, said so just pet me. Just pet me. Just give me the love. Mm, yeah. Oh, yeah. I gotta wash my hands and get cooking. So, oh my gosh, y'all are being so cute. Look at them. They love each other. Oh, wow. I'm going to eat you. Yeah. Oh, sir. You're not supposed to have the camera. No. He just wants the camera. They're doing really good. Um, Joy, especially. Hannah's always pretty well behaved. She is an angel, actually. She typically, when I'm cooking, she naturally comes and... <gasps> really? Did you throw the camera? Why'd you do that? You can't have my camera. You can't have my camera. You gonna help me cook? So there's Hannah in her spot, as always when I cook. This is what she does. Okay. She's such a good girl. Yes. I have to look spoon. Look, by the way, I have a um, cute little cutting board and all that. Merch line. Of a mint that says uh, lick spoon. It has a little dog nose on it. I'll drop the link down. So cute. Mm -hmm. Okay. No idea how this is going to turn out. Hopefully it turns out good. We shall definitely see. So this is the um, culprit of um, all the chaos. So um, it's very quiet. I really like this thing. It's normally $200 on Amazon and currently I think it's $59. Um, it's very, very nice. I got it for a deal. And I bought this specifically just for vacuuming my kitchen cabinets my countertops and things like that. So this never touches the floor. It never touches anything that's not food related. Um, so, and it works really good. So I highly recommend this thing. So it really just kind of gets the stuff up. So. Yeah. So that's what I like that for. Okay, no, we're done. We're done. All done. No more. We gotta finish making the brownies for daddy and then I gotta cook his casserole, okay? Do I have chocolate on my face? Might have peanut butter. The peanut butter, the peanut butter cookie dough that goes with this is really good. So it's 12 o'clock almost and hubby should be getting out of church soon. Um, Normally we go to church too, but the baby gets car sick and our church is 35 minutes away. And um, so we decided to give his little tummy a break. Yeah. 
Um, which if you've not used this cleaning spray, this stuff is amazing. It smells so good. It's a parsley spray. Parsley spray. Yeah. It smells good. It smells clean, but without a strong like. Like it's not strong, but it's fresh. I don't know. It's very fresh smelling, and I love it. Um, hubby found it at Walmart for just a few dollars, but you can get it on Amazon. Sir, what you doing? Get out of my sink! Get out of my sink! Get out of my sink! Please get out of my sink! Come on, out of the sink. Mama's trying to cook. No, I asked you to get out of the sink, okay? I will wash those in a minute, okay? No, honey. I appreciate you wanting to help. But let Mama do it soon, okay? You can help me later. Let me cook, let me get dinner going. Let me get lunch cooking, okay? And then you can help me. Anyone else have a child that is like super in the cleaning? No, just mine? He gets so upset, like, if the, well, he's less, he likes messes he made, but he loves to clean. All right. So I got my casserole dish. Woo! So camera's on the charger. Turned out I had a charger in the kitchen. That works just fine. So I got my avocado spray. Um, one of the things I started doing is spraying my casserole dish down to help it not stick. This thing is um, very well loved, so it's um, kind of, kind of. That comes out thick. Wow. All right, so that's greased. Let's see. We've got my cream of mush, uh, cream of chicken. Normally, I make it with cream of mushroom, but my oldest child does not like mushrooms, so we're gonna try it with cream of chicken. My friend who does not like cream of mushroom, she makes it with cream of chicken, so we are gonna try it. Let's see how it turns out. So I already have ground beef cooked up. You want some candy? Can you sit? Yeah. Yeah, good girl. Didn't even touch me. I don't know if y'all saw that. Spatula. To get the cream of mushroom out. Actually, I'll probably end up using it to mix. So one of the things I like to do is, so we buy big things of ground beef. At, all at once and then my husband he has a flat top grill and so he cooks the beef really really fast and then we bag it up he weighs it out and um so that way I can when I need to cook and I want to make I don't know spaghetti or a casserole or whatever I can I don't have to worry about trying to ha add that extra step because I've got little kids and they're kind of cranky. So I, I'll just add a little bit of uh, garlic salt into the, can you see it? Let me turn the camera so you can see it. There we go. So I've got my cream of chicken, got my ground beef. Now I'm just going to lightly season it because this already has seasoning in it. And I mix this too. We're gonna have brownie. Look, the brownie's cooking. The brownie's cooking. It's gonna be nummy nummies. And Brody's tummy. Okay, so I'm going to pre-mix. Uh, you can't go outside by yourself, buddy. Ask Sissy if she wants to go outside. All right, so I like to go ahead and pre-mix this um, up. Makes it a lot easier. Ah, ah. I um, also <laughs> use a lot of cheese. And I go ahead and I mix. Um, this is mild cheddar. You can use sharp. I love it with extra sharp, but our kids don't like as sharp as cheese as we like. I also really like the Cabot um, cheese and trying it myself, but that takes time. And like I said, the kids don't like it, so why this one? Hey, thank 
you. Yes, good girl. You're supposed to be staying. You're not supposed to be running around. I like to mix this in. I think I'm going to add some milk because back on your bottom. Stay. I want you to stay. Good girl. Working on the, hey, you have to listen even if you don't want to for longer durations. Good stay. Add just a little bit of moisture so it mixes better. I'm gonna leave that out. Okay. Okay. You can get up now. Thank you. All right, let's see if this mixes better now. The cream of mushroom, I have to say, mixes a little bit better than the cream of chicken. But we're trying something new for my kid. I have made this with cream of chicken before, but I've never actually tried it because I made this for my friend um, when her second child was a baby. Good grief, that's been a lot of years. Um... He's what, seven now? All right, that may be too much, but no, I don't think so. The cheese will melt and that'll help give some moisture too. It won't be bad. So that's mixed. Now we're gonna open up my tater tots. Like I said, most people line the, they do layers. Personally, I don't like doing that because I find that the tater tots are dry and they stick to the bottom of the pan. Um, so I always mix it together. See, it's mixing up very nicely. And again, I like the cheese mixed in. Um, Hannah is laying down behind me. I don't know if you could see that. Can you see her? There she is. She's such a good girl. Joy would be trying to figure out how to get on the counter so that she could steal the food. That's what Joy would be doing. So that's why Joy is in the kennel. Um, while we're doing this, we try to do it with her out, but she was just getting into stuff. So, you know, there's nothing wrong with popping her in the kennel for a little bit. Oh, so when I was naming things for my kitchen, oh, the fridge is Val, I forgot to mention. Um, you might notice that there is a particular pattern with the names. Bertha is not named after a sitcom character, but a lot of my appliances are. Um, and I don't know why I name stuff. My dad names stuff. I get that from him, I guess. So, what are you getting from the fridge, girly friend? Something to eat. Well, baby, I'm about to pick. This is lunch. I'm about to put it in the oven. Okay, so that's that. Look how lovely. Alright, so now I'm gonna, yeah, I use two bags of cheese. So this is a very expensive meal because, um, the tater tot casserole that I use is expensive. The cream of mushroom or cream of chicken ice soup I use is more expensive. The cheese I use is more expensive and I use a lot of it, so, um, yeah, it's gonna tear. That's all right. So this is not my favorite meal. I like it okay, but this is this is what my hubby likes. This is his favorite meal, and like I said, 10 minutes till the brownies are done. Um, I think Hannah's getting more used to, oh, no, never mind. She stood up, okay. She's like, what, what'd I do? I didn't do anything. The beep sounds very similar to her e-collar fence thingy. Okay, so here we go. All the cheese. So, um, so this is a very indulgent dish and it's Father's Day and this is my hubby's favorite meal and you know, we have four kids so I think he deserves to have a indulgent food. I'm going to put this in the oven in just a few minutes and it's going to be delicious. So, and we'll be pulling out the brownies soon. Peace.
Do we want to eat at the table? Or do we want to sit and watch a movie? Mm -hmm. We can do that. What would Dad like to do? Okay. Oh, I wanted to film me pulling that out of the other one. So the yummies are out of the oven, and there's the man of the day. Happy Father's Day, Ryan and Hannah. If you really want to wish him a happy Father's Day, don't lick him. He doesn't like the puppy kisses. Actually, no one likes your incessant licking. No, mm -mm, no one. Just you. You're the only one. So we're going to let this cool for a minute. Let him get settled and we're gonna have a movie day. So peace out for the rest of the day.